Hello everyone, today we will have a detailed look at Toontastic 3D. Toontastic 3D is a playful storytelling app that scaffolds the creative writing process and empowers kids to create their own animated cartoons. It is available only on the mobile platforms iOS and Android. While Toontastic was not specifically designed for schools, most of the teachers can use it in the class for activities giving a lot of graphic contents. At the same time, students use the app for creating everything from book reports to news broadcasts and foreign language skills. Toontastic 3D is not developed for a certain age. It is for everyone from every country, for every any age. And the most important thing is Toontastic 3D is totally free. In Toontastic 3D, we need to follow a story arc. What is a story arc? A story arc is a scaffolding tool that helps you map out a story's plot. Toontastic 3D has three different story arcs. First of them is short story. Short story has three parts. At the beginning, you introduce the characters and the setting of your story. At the middle, something happens, like a problem. At the end, your story wraps up. Second of them is classic story. Classic story has five parts. At the setup, you introduce the story setting and characters. At the conflict, you create a problem for your characters. At the challenge, you make the problem even more difficult. At the climax, you help the characters solve the problem. At the resolution, you show the problem has been solved. Third and the last of them is science reports. Science report has five parts. At the question, you start by asking a research question. What do you want to know? At the hypothesis, you state your hypothesis. What do you think will happen? At the experiment, you explain your experiment. What data are you collecting and what's your control? At the results, you analyze your results. What observations did you make? At the conclusions, you make a conclusion. What did you learn? And do you have any more questions? So, what can Toontastic be used for? It is actually up to you. You can create anything, depends on your imagination. You can use it for your class or your YouTube channel. Even you can make your students create some cartoons. You can give your students a storyline and they will follow it with different cartoons. As I said it, it is up, totally up to your imagination. At the same time, Toontastic 3D can be used offline. You don't need internet connection to use it. As an example, let's make a short story. Making a story is really easy on Toontastic. As I said before, short story has three parts. We should start with the beginning. In the beginning, we introduce our characters and the setting of our story. Firstly, we, sh we need to pick a setting for our story. There are lots of settings like high school, crater, dojo from the game Fruit Ninja, Tunic's Temple and lots of them. These are really good. I want the camp, what was that? This is a spooky camp. And we need some characters. There are limitless characters, as you see. City, Space, Fruit Ninja, Explorers, Pirates, Atlantis, Spy, Spooky Camp and Airpunks. And also, you can draw your own character. Let's draw a person. 
I'm not really good at drawing though. So this is it. Let's delete this for now. I need characters like Scout Brent. Yes, this is really good. I need also Scout Cassandra and Scout Timbre as a something like a ghost. These are my characters. So, I can place my characters just like this, and she's here, and Brent is here. Let's start doing it. Oh, this is really cold out here. Oh, oh. There is a camp and there is a fire. I can make myself comfortable here. I can sit here. This is really good. Oh, it's cold outside. Mm. Oh, there is a camp and there is someone. Oh, hello. I'm Scout Cassandra. Can I sit here? Oh, hello Cassandra. I'm Brent. Nice to meet you. Of course you can sit here. Okay, thank you. And this is my beginning to my story. And I can get some music here. Some spooky music. These music are really good too. And it was the beginning. And in the middle, something happens, like a problem, as I said earlier. Spooky camp. And my characters were Scott Brent, Scott Cassandra, and some Timbre. Yes. Timbre was here. Cassandra was sitting here. And... Brent was here. Let's start this. Oh, there is some noise. What is it? I don't know. It's really spooky. What are you doing in my camp? This is my camp and you didn't get my permission. Oh. We are really sorry, sir. We we won't do it again. Uh, we are really sorry. We can go now. Oh, yeah, yes, sir. It was really cold and we were really cold. We can go get out of here right now. And it was the middle sequence of my story. And I can get a terrified music here. Yeah, it is that easy. And for the ending, your story wraps up. Spooky Camp, Brent, Cassandra, and Tom Timbre again. Timbre, Cassandra is here, and Brent is here. Let's start. I will kill you both. You didn't get my permission to enter my camp. You will be dead now. No, let's get out of here. Run. Ha ha ha. This is my camp. And no one can, can get enter my camp without my permission. I'm the king of this camp. So, this is it. Let's add a spooky music again. And that's it. Let's finish. And the title 
the title can be Spooky Camp and the director is me, of course. This is it. Yeah, Spooky Camp directed by me. That's it. This is pretty simple, as you see. So, as I said, using Toontastic 3D is pretty simple because the interface enables you to do anything that you want. You can use it in the classroom and you can get your students to know about it and they can use it too as homeworks or as an entertainment for the language. So, this is it. Thank you. Oh, this is really cold out here. Oh, oh, there is a camp and there is a fire. I can make myself comfortable here. I can sit here. This is really good. Oh, it's cold outside. Mm. Oh, there is a camp and there is someone. Oh, hello. I'm Scout Cassandra. Can I sit here? Oh, hello Cassandra, I'm Brent. Nice to meet you. Of course you can sit here. Okay, thank you. Oh, there is some noise. What is it? I don't know, it's really spooky. What are you doing in my camp? This is my camp and you didn't get my permission. Oh, we are really sorry, sir. We we won't do it again. Uh, we're really sorry. We can go now. Oh, yeah, yes, sir. It was really cold, and we were really cold. We can go get out of here right now. I will kill you both. You didn't get my permission to enter my camp. You will be dead now. No, let's get out of here. Run. Ha ha ha. This is my camp and no one can can get enter my camp without my permission. I'm the king of this camp.
I can swim, I can swim quite a fish, I can go to the river. Fishman saved the boat, and now they are safe and alive. Oh, it's so cold. I'm freezing. I'm talking to that's where I'm fire. Yes, good idea. Come. Oh, he is our hero. He saved us. It's so nice to be alive. Yes, thank you, Fishman. Okay, right. And we have